Gloss Twinkies. And um, I'm back today to show you another wig review. And today we will be reviewing... I hope that this view, um, I mean this camera angle and lighting is a lot better than what I've been using. Um, the other day I was in the living room, or the kitchen, excuse me. And so, um, hopefully the lighting is a little bit better here. Um, what I am going to be reviewing today is from the Janet Collection Pearl, <clears throat> Pearl Editions, Full Lace Wig Nikki, okay? Um, I found her to be cute on the website, you know, a uh, really cute hairstyle there. And what I got her in is a Piano FS42730. She's kind of sort of a short, sassy, um, spiral curl type wig. Really cute. And, uh, yeah, here she is. Alright. So, let's get her out of the package here. I've already cut the lace off in the front, so, um, yeah. Now, she is, excuse me, premium synthetic fibers. Um, it does not say that she's heat resistant, so I wouldn't apply any heat to her. I'm just cutting the, snipping the tag off real quick. Now, she did come with uh, a few strips of tape, top stick on the back here. And what we'll do is we're not going to glue her down. Not going to glue her down today. Okay. Now, here she is. You see all those beautiful colors in her little short, springy, summery type of wig? Okay. She does not, as with all Pearl Collection wigs um, from the Janet Collection, they do not have that much lace. As you can see, it is probably a half of an inch or the width of my finger. Okay. The width of my finger right here. Uh, it does not, I mean, it has two combs in the front, uh, tracks, a little bit of uh, netting here. So this look, wig probably would be good for summer because it looks like it's breathable. Um, and it does have a little bit of lace in the back. Uh, I did not have to cut this. Uh, it just came like that. And it has one comb and in adjustable straps. So I didn't have to cut the lace off the back, it just came like that. So uh, I think that's a, a pretty nice little feature there. Trying to cut the lace off the back sometimes is a little bit difficult. And uh, yeah. Alright. Now, I have to let y'all know this. If you look in the inside of your wig, there's, if you on the tabs here on the side, if you feel right here, there's going to be a piece of metal, and I'm not sure, yeah, you can see that. It's right there. And this way, you don't have to glue it down. You do not have to glue this wig down. All you have to do is just bend the sides to your temples, and it will hold it close. All right, so if I'm, I'm about to look like Shirley Temple, so I don't want to hear nothing, y'all. Okay. <laughs> Here we go. Ooh. we. Just working with the curls. I need to look at her picture again because right now it's not working. <laughs> Woo! All right. But we're going to fix it. We're going to work her out because she's cute. She just needs some styling. Ain't got a life of its own, y'all. Ebony, you're going to have to tame this one. You're going to have to go get it and show us how to whip it out. Because right now, I'm looking like, whoa. Okay, this so right here, what I'm like. doing I've is defeated, trying to separate oh, some of the curls goodness, and try and get a general style to the wig. Um, she was very hard for me to style uh, in the beginning, but you will see the end result. It did come out pretty good, but I was not happy. <laughs> 
having to do all this to a wig but I guess you know once I get uh, the shaper out and start shaping it it maybe it'll look a little bit better it, it does look a lot better once I get to shape it um, with the razor and things but separating the curls and stuff like that you probably only have to do it one time uh, since I just pulled this one out the pack and didn't play with it first that's why it's like that okay so right here I broke out the uh, razor you can get one of those at your local BSS or beauty supply store and right here I'm just taking a little bit of length off of the sides where my ears are um, the curls hung a little bit you know bushy around my ears so I felt like I should taper it close give the wig a little bit of shape and um, it actually worked out you know sometimes you gotta make the wig your own and that's exactly what I'm doing right now I'm just taking a lot of the bulk out of the wig because it is a very full wig and um, just giving it some shape on the sides and around my ears I didn't get to shape the back of the wig though and um, I had to actually take her off to do that because I, I would have messed it up because I couldn't see and I don't want the wig to have a bad shape but it has some very pretty colors in it very pretty colors alright y'all here's the rest of the video and I'm just finishing up her shaping and there there it is from the sides as you can see in the back I messed up and um, needed to take the wig off of my head in order to style it but overall I think she's she's looking good I like that little blonde spot right up in the front that is just so popping to me <laughs> but I'm just primping with the little wig just trying to get it how I want it so I'm thinking that um, if you like big hair this is gonna be the one for you um, okay this is Miss Nikki um, it is a more mature looking hairstyle uh, I think I probably okay will so right here I'm just making some baby hairs to try and get a more realistic look on hairline it is kind of moon shape so I'm pulling out a little bit of my own hair um, I said I wasn't gonna play with the wig anymore but I just wanted to see what I could do with her and um, the curls on the side I mean the curls are really pretty and so what I wanted to try here is that Keisha Cole look with the bangs down um, just to see what I can get and I think it actually looks pretty cute this way I think it looks really cute I don't know y'all have to tell me what you think cuz <laughs> I was just playing with her to try and see what kind of styles I can get out of her but tapering the side definitely gave to me gave the wig a uh, new life All right, y'all. This is my review on Miss Nikki. Um, she's going to take a little bit of getting used to or a little bit more styling. Um, but for the most part, I think she all right. She all right. I'm just going to trim a little bit more off the back um, just to see what it looked like. It, uh, if you like big curly hair, this is the one for you. Uh, I'm going to keep messing with her until I can see what I can do with her. Okay? So, that will be my review. And I hope y'all like her. Do it look like I got a jerry curl, y'all? Come on now. My soul glow, baby. Y'all getting tired of hearing me say all the time, How you doing? How you doing? Um, let me know your honest opinion. Uh, if you like big hair, this is for you. This one is for you. I, I will be rocking her again. Guarantee it.